David. Well, uh, Peter, perhaps we should have a look now at how Labour is doing. They've almost scored every hit they needed, haven't they? I, and I, more. Well, I think one or two exceptions. But the devastating thing about this Labour victory is the way they've hit so effectively uh, in the areas that they needed to do it in. I mean, up in the Scottish and the North areas and the, and the Wales and so on, the swing has been nothing like as big as it has been down in this devastatingly important area to them in the south where all those Tory marginals are 14 percent I mean it's a record-breaking swing by any standard since the war 14 percent swing in the south and in London uh, 11 percent there uh, in places like the Midlands and the result of that is that when we look at our targets and we see how well Tony Blair's party's aim has been it is absolutely devastating particularly in these clusters down here still a few results to come let me just uh, Lose, lose the ones that haven't yet been declared. You can see there, these are the safer, uh, these were the safer Tory seats. So it seats like Portsmouth North uh, here and, for example, Dumfries in Scotland. And these ones, like uh, the Vale of Glamorgan, were very unsafe, very small Tory majority before. Now, as we fly around, uh, watch the hits here clocking up in the little hit box. The first one we're going for is Plymouth Sutton, then Exeter, you can see just beyond it there. There goes Exeter. Here comes Portsmouth North, the most difficult of those targets to hit. You can just see Simon Hughes surviving in the middle of London, but surrounded by those great skyscrapers of red in London. So one Liberal Democrat survives, uh, but otherwise just devastation everywhere. And huge Labour majorities building up where those powerful Tory majorities were before. Sterling in uh, Scotland, Michael Forsyth's seat going up there, the last one. And you can see there that, yes, the uh, Welsh nationalists have survived in Ceredigion, uh, and also Simon Hughes, of course, uh, in London. But otherwise, it's going to be 98 hits on that target and two misses only. David. Thanks, Peter. Uh, not all Tory ministers have, um, have uh, taken the, the plunge tonight or walked the plank. Folkestone and Hyde, for instance, Michael Howard with a split opposition from Liberal Democrats.